Doja Cat is out and about and everyone has been wondering, you know, what's going on with Doja? Why are these creepy tattoos, you know, on her skin? Like, what is she doing? Is Doja in the Illuminati? Listen, guys, I think everyone loves to overreact. Like, it's okay to be in art, you know? You know, Doja Cat, if you watched her previous interviews and, you know, get to know her as a rapper and the background that she was raised, you know, her mom, you know, is a very famous artist. Like, her mom does drawings, paintings, and I think that's where her influence comes from. Like, everyone has this thing where they see something so different and they're so quick to judge and to draw you through the mud without even doing a proper research, you know? I think Doja is fine. She's not crazy. I think she's just exploring more, knowing about culture stuff, aspects of her as a, as a person. You know, you don't only get to be a rapper or a doctor or a lawyer. You get to learn other things in life. And I think it's very crazy where people we'll see another person do something different and it's okay to go on social media and to attack that person but guys like everyone has this issue with accepting themselves and i think it's the person who has an issue accepting themselves those are the persons who have an issue when they see someone do something different and see people go about their lives being happy doing whatever they want to do like be for real you know if you guys are gonna bash Doja and say that she's crazy, y'all should commend her for, you know, what a great artist or rapper she is because I think this girl is genuinely talented. Like Doja is super talented. And I think people wanna talk about the bad instead of the good. And I think it's very unfair that I get people get to have their own opinion, but does it feel okay to basically chastise someone like to even make them cry or to feel humiliated that they don't feel like there's no sense of purpose for themselves anymore like i don't like bullies and y'all need to chill on the media because i think doja is different everyone is different in their own unique way and we all need to accept how people are like be for real if y'all is unhappy with your life just say that instead of coming out on social media bashing people who are happy with their lives it's giving you know toxic like i think half of social media is toxic like the platform is is used to have you know opinions and such but when you get to that level of bringing people down like what do you get from that it's just so it's such a waste of time you know, and I think Doja doesn't care about the haters or what anyone has to say about her. I think she's just living her life, doing what she wants to do. And while y'all spending that time bashing her, she's spending quality time getting to know about herself and, you know, adventures, culture and stuff. And when you see people, you know, being busy, learning stuff like they have the benefit because then you're there bashing someone when you could have been using that time you know promoting yourself bettering yourself and that's what makes this thing called life very tricky and twisted so we spend half of the time on social media bashing people when we could be learning from them you know how weird is that how weird is that and to add to that actually she's still putting out music her music is still trending and you know her song attention it's been super super trendy on tiktok so this girl is making money regardless of what anyone has to say and i think she knows how to keep people talking and that's what i really love about doja she markets herself she knows exactly what to do i think she is even marketable without a team and that's real talent there baby y'all could never compare doja to anyone she is so unique i haven't seen anyone like doja you know she loves nikki but i'm not gonna say she is trying to be nikki she is just herself doja doesn't act like nikki and nikki doesn't act like doja period that's what i'm trying to say okay she is a pioneer for her artistic 
a natural being and i love that i really love that and i love her new uh tatted uh stuff that she got on her skin i love her tattoos they're so cute and i don't know what they mean actually but i'm just saying you know she gets to be herself everyone gets to be herself and you don't like if you don't like it then you need to get some therapy boo boo but let me know what y'all think about doja cat you know getting her skin tatted with all these stuff that's going on and do you think she should be worried about people not accepting her for who she is let me know down below in that comment section guys i don't think doja is weird but let me know what y'all think leave a comment below sure if you care and don't forget to click that subscribe button hit that notification bell see y'all next time bye guys